a jury has recommended Kyler Yu spend the next four decades of his life in prison. They made the recommendation around 1.30 this afternoon. Following a voluntary manslaughter verdict for Kara Kopetsky's death, they voted on 15 years in prison. And in Jessica Runyon's second degree murder verdict, life in prison with the possibility of parole after 30 years. KMBC Nine's Matt Fleener was there when the families of both young women spoke beforehand. And Matt, they pleaded with the jury for a long sentence. Laura, and they got it. The max that Kyler Hughes can spend in prison is 45 years, and that's exactly what the families wanted here. The weight of two young girls gone, showing itself in a Cass County courtroom on Friday. First, the family of Kara Kopetsky, who went missing from Belton High School in 2007. When I think about her, she reminds me who I am. And, and really, that's the... That's, that's, that's the greatest thing to me that anybody can do is help, you know, in your thoughts, in your dreams. They can remind you who you are. Kara was amazing. She was exceptional. She was likable. And I thought that's just the tip of who Kara was. Kara would have made the world a better place. And the world is a colder and darker place without Kara in it. She was such a bright, shining light that was snuffed out way too early and too soon. Then the family of Jessica Runyons, who went missing in 2016. I have to sit and watch all of her friends, have babies, get married, live their life. I don't get to walk my daughter down the aisle and see her be married and be a mother. Our family is broken forever. She always made sure she told me that she loved me, and sometimes I didn't say it right away, but she always told me to say it back, and I did. I love you so much, Jessica, if you're listening. And as you always said, say it back.